the police command has announced the dismantling of a fake job syndicate and the rescue of 16 victims in Igrita, Iquiri local government area. The State Commission of Police, or La Tunji Disu, disclosed this at the press briefing at the command headquarters in Port Harcourt. Disu explained that the syndicate was uncovered when police operatives responded to a distress call from concerned residents who suspected a hostage situation. The suspect had posed as company staff and potential employers to the fraud on suspecting job seekers. group of people who are involved in employment scam, free fraud, advanced free fraud and employment scam. They send messages all over to people that they have jobs for them to do here in River State. The job they employ to them or they advertise to them, they claim has to do with oil and gas. Everybody wants to work in the oil and gas section of employment. So they all rush down to River State. And when they get to River State, these scammers tell them that they are there to sell a product called buildings and ship pendants. And they start training of these people who are looking for employment. To open registration, to be registered for these sales of these products, Everybody has to pay the sum of 750,000 Naira, and some have paid as much as 1.5 million Naira to be registered to sell buildings and ship pendants. And that after two weeks, they will start getting their dividends in dollars. The police boss also paraded a five-man armed robbery gang allegedly responsible for car snatching and burglary in part of Port Harcourt and Obiakbo local government areas of the state. I was invited to come for an interview to work with an oil and gas company. Along the line I came and that was when they now said that I have to pay a sum of uh, money, 850,000 naira, uh, which I, comp I as at that time I don't have money so I told them I, the money I have with me is uh, 750. They now asked me that I should pay. On reaching there, that was when I now found out it's not, a, it's not an oil and uh, company, it's just a kind of uh, training ground. They call it training ground. So I was there, you understand, they now say it is, they, it is a business purpose. That what they told us from the beginning is a strategy, you understand? That if they didn't do that one, there's no way I can come over. The first police command has prevailed over a five man gang responsible for snatching and burglary in other George. In warfare, and Oboguru area of Potakot. Other locations of the operations are Egbelu, Dio, D-Line, GRA2, and Borokiri. The gang has been responsible for snatching at gunpoint over 10 cars in the last three months. And they have been terrorizing River State residents seeking to enjoy the comfort and thrills of nightlife. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.